Ian Happ against Johnny Cueto. Kyle Schwarber with a first inning homer. And the slider misses. Off the inside, six game run streak for the rookie Happ, who's come to the plate 33 times since he got brought up from the minors. He's reached 15. You know, there's been nothing fluky about it. He's made a lot of solid contact, banging the ball all over the park. A couple of times into the seats, and another shot. One hopper to the Gold Glover Panic. Giga time moment. It is powered by Xfinity. How about these plays early last night? Yeah, it was fun to watch. Back to back, in fact. Yeah. Russell and Elmora. Double play here started by Contreras. Anthony Rizzo made a great play late in the ball game, and then here tonight. Russell scrambling to his feet after the great pick to start that double play. Hayward, deep right. It is gone. Basket shot. Two nothing. Well, we've talked uh, a fair bit this year about Jason's uh, new approach at the plate. We've talked a lot about his mechanics and how he's changed his hands. And, but the other thing, he's been a lot more aggressive early, and this is a, an ambush on a first pitch from Cueto right there for him where he likes it. A little bit up above the knees where he can get extended and launch. Ford home run replay for the second time tonight. The Cubs go deep. It's number four for Hayward. Swing and a miss. A nasty sinker. Contreras hitting 368 on the homestand. Okay. Uh, this is a, this is a, a good game plan the Cubs have here tonight. Hit a bunch of solo home runs. Keep the game moving. Make sure you get five innings in with the bad weather. But we're only that easy. Plato makes quick work of Contreras for his third strikeout already. And now Addison Russell. Well, without fail, the crew chief Jeff Nelson has uh, taken a look at the radar with the help of the grounds crew uh, between every half inning. So the goal here is to at least get five innings in the books. An early lead is paramount. It's a movie studio too, right? Correct. Line to left. Nunez on the move. Cubs homering in each of the first two innings. Schwarber in the first. Hayward here in the second. And it's 2 nothing. This copyrighted telecast is presented by the authority of the Chicago Cubs and may not be reproduced or retransmitted in any form. And the accounts and descriptions of this game may not be disseminated without the express written consent of the Chicago Cubs. I'm attorney Howard Ankin with Cubs great Andre Dawson. Hard work is the best way to succeed. That's why if you need a lawyer, you need to call my hawk, Howard. If you or someone you know needs help with an injury case, call me. 312-6 million. Injury law. Made personal. Inside the rack houses of Jim Beam, every barrel's aged four long years for a fuller, smoother flavor. Our history's made from the inside. How will you make yours? Thursday on CSN, Texas native Arturo Alvarez faces his former team as the Fire head back home to host FC Dallas. Coverage begins at 7 with Chicago Fire pregame. Thursday on CSN. At Fields, we're known for our complimentary loaners. 
Hello, I'm Dan Fields, and now you can take a loaner home and keep it. It's Fields' first ever loaner sales event. Every current low mileage, hand-picked, and pampered loaner will be sold or leased for less like this. Get 2.49% APR for 36 to 60 months and $5,000 off all XC60, V60, and S60 loaners at Fields Volvo Northfield. Fields' first ever loaner sales event. But hurry, this is a limited time offer. Fields Volvo Northfield on Frontage Road. I've always believed that caring for families is the best way to keep our community healthy and safe. Which is why I do things like provide opportunities for children to learn through the Reading Buddies program, help fund child safety programs, and give to the homeless. It's also why I got into personal injury law. It gives me the opportunity to help people at a time of tremendous loss. Because helping injured people win justice is its own reward. Welcome back, folks. Uh, tomorrow, the Cubs and the Giants are going to play baseball. They're going to do so at the 7.05, and up to the first 10,000 early arriving fans will receive a Silver Slugger Award canvas print presented by Think Energy by NG. For more information, visit Cubs.com. Two zip, Cubs lead. Eduardo Nunez comes in with a career high tying nine game hitting streak. And Lester's first offering is fouled back. I see not much separation between that batting average and the on base percentage because he doesn't walk much. He likes to swing it. Two. Slow wind in the pitch. Ground ball to Bryant. Lots of time. Thursday, the league's top goal scorer against the league's top defense. Nemanja Nikolic and your Chicago Fire trying to continue their winning ways as they host FC Dallas. Coverage starts at 7 on CSN with Chicago Fire. Three games. Told you to bring the blue blanket tonight, not the pink blanket. <laughs> Inside corner on Gorky Hernandez. Snap and 0 for 15. A little bit in tight. Two not, and one. Not a bad idea for a giant, uh, especially if you can run a little bit. The bunt on a wet field. You know, John Lester doesn't like to make those throws. Center field, Ian Happ. So two outs, it'll bring up the pitcher, Cueto. Pitching matchup tomorrow night. Left-hander, Matt Moore. Against right-hander, Kyle Hendricks. And then on Thursday, former Cub, Jeff Samarja. He got off to a really slow start, but has been much better as of late. Will oppose... Eddie Butler. There's the shark. Yeah, looking at his numbers earlier, he's pitched way better than his record and even better than his ERA would indicate. And look at the peripherals. Struck out seven for every man he has walked so far this year. 
Moore had that terrific start in game four. He got a tough no decision. And the Cubs clincher last October. The 0 2 is outside. Ball strike three. It's four for Lester, nine batters in. He's got a 2 0 lead in the third. Supercharged muscle car goes 0 to 60 in 3.1 seconds. The chain of an echo chainsaw, 0 to 60 in 1.2. Gentlemen, start your engines. Power on and on. Babe, I've got T-Mobile. It's all unlimited, so I've got unlimited access to all things MLB. Are you sure that means all things? Yeah, totally. Oh. Good morning, Bryce. Dude, what what time is it? Funny filter time. <laughs> Say something funny. I'm not that funny. Yeah, still kind of funny. Thanks. I got unlimited right. data, so we can just keep going. Thanks. That's how he wakes up. I know. Like perfectly quaffed. T-Mobile One. Stream, post, and share all things MLB on the most advanced LTE network. Unlimited data means unlimited baseball. On the next NBC5 News, after the huge Target data breach, the state comes down hard on the retailer. So what will it mean for you? An NBC5 exclusive. Then, where's the sun? Grant Miller is tracking your holiday weekend forecast. On the next NBC5 News. The NBC Chicago app is your new home for weather. Even use the interactive radar to track this week's storm right down to your neighborhood. From severe weather alerts, local conditions, and breaking news as it happens, get everything you need all in the NBC Chicago app. What is driving performance? It's not a weekend hobby. You have to live and breathe it for 50 years. It's the sound and the fury. It's letting it all hang out there, and it's hanging on for dear life. That is what AMG driving performance means. And this is where it lives. The 503 horsepower Mercedes AMG C63 S2. Welcome back. Cub fans, help send your Cubs to Miami for the 2017 All-Star Game. Vote early, vote often, vote now at cubs.com slash vote. You can vote up to five times a day and 35 times total. Oh, and one on John Lester. Cubs lead two to nothing. Change up. Oh, and two. That's a tough pitch, that change up with the quick pitch delivery. Hard not to jump at that ball. Plato signed originally with the Reds 2004. Traded to Kansas City in 2015 and then signed with the Giants prior to last year. Six year contract worth $130 million. And he has an opt out after this season, but it's hard to imagine that he would exercise that. Given the amount of money they owe him going forward. Swing and a miss. He got him. But I guess if he were to pitch lights out and put up huge numbers, he might be willing to take a chance on the free agent market again. Plato was the National League All-Star starter last year so was a teammate of a bunch of these Cubs including Ben Zobrist who takes a strike
really like the way Ben Zobris talks about the game in, in this way. He admits how hard it is. We, we had a shot of him earlier this season playing catch in front of the Cubs dugout. You know, five minutes before the first pitch, which he does every day. And uh, he really gets into it. And I, I told him how big a kick I get out of watching him do that as he dunks one in the left. He said, well, I have to do it. Uh, he was asked by reporters this week about being a leadoff hitter. And he said, it's really hard. There's, there's a self-awareness I think he has that's, that's pretty refreshing. Yeah, he takes nothing for granted uh, the way he approaches and the way he plays the game. So he's been on base. He uh, hit Walker hit by pitch in 21 consecutive games. Now Schwarber who pummeled one onto Sheffield his first time and takes a pitch outside for a ball. Yeah, you could have chopped that thing up into a 10 game hitting streak. I mean, that thing was mashed. That's a strike. And so, Cueto staying away and staying soft here. There's the, the home run pitch. At first look, I thought it maybe had hit the back of that platform and bounced onto Sheffield, but on that look, I think it just went right onto the that street. Flew out there, yeah. Guessing when Kyle plays golf, he, he doesn't opt to lay up very often. One ball, one strike. Throw the first out. Oh, Zobris quick. Just got picked off. I think Zobrist is saying to Jeff Nelson, I thought he balked. Really quick feet by Cueto. Belt applies the tag, and you get a good look at it there. Not only was he quick, the throw was about as good as you could possibly make. So. Nobody on two outs and a one two count on Schwarber. It's not a particularly big lead. And I didn't see anything there in the move. See Zobris was making his case with Jeff Nelson that maybe there was a little twitch. From Cueto with the shoulder, but couldn't tell with that look. Bryant on deck. Two-two count on Schwarber. Delayed just over an hour before we got started. We were supposed to start an hour early. Called strike three. After three, Cubs two, Giants nothing. Honda knows that versatility has its advantages. That's why the Honda HRV crossover adapts smoothly to every adventure, helps you get to every destination more efficiently, and gives you a better view of your surroundings. The HRV crossover from KBB.com's 2017 Best Value brand. Nothing compares to a Honda. Visit your Chicagoland and Northwest Indiana Honda dealer and test drive a Honda today. To be in the Express, you gotta be able to ride. And I mean really ride. Jack, wait. Ma, I ain't no boy no more. You don't know what's out there. It's dangerous. It's just something I have to do, Ma. But the job only calls to a man who has what it takes. You take this and you go west as fast as you can. See him again, Ma? I reckon. How can you be so sure? Because West is that way. Hello? 
This is she. Is that the doctor? Okay, wow, really? It's two? It's two. That's great news, thank you. It's two? Yes, it's two. It's two for one windows at Feldco. Feldco is offering two windows for the price of one with fantastic financing available. Two windows for the price of one ends Memorial Day. Hurry, call now. For quality windows, siding, and doors, call 866 for Feldco. Cole Kyler is a diehard Cubs fan whose parents surprised him with Cubs tickets. He quickly turned into a viral sensation. We had no idea that sharing it would go crazy like the way it did. In a recent trip to White Sox AAA affiliate Charlotte, we got a glimpse of budding superstar Yoan Moncada. And Kelly Crawl introduces us to the Zach sisters, how the youngest is hoping to be the first female in the NHL. You'll just get tougher along the way, and that's all you need to do. Just gain the skills, and you'll be fine. A new episode of The Extra Point, tomorrow at 11 on CSN. Tomorrow, in an all-new episode of The Extra Point, we meet up with Colt, the nine-year-old diehard Cubs fan whose parents surprised him with a trip to Wrigley. Plus, we hit the ice with a young local hockey player who hopes to be the first female to play in the NHL. All that and more on The Extra Point tomorrow at 11 on CSN. John Lester back to work. Inside to Joel Panic. Fourth inning, two nothing Cubs. Kyle Schwarber with the longest home run of his young career, 470 feet. Hayward homered in the second as Panic grounds out. Hey, I want to give a shout out to our good friend Tom uh, Farinella, a longtime umpire room attendant here at Wrigley Field. Tom uh, has retired. Ken Corso has uh, taken over the uh, main duties in the umpire room, but uh, we want to wish Tom the best in retirement. And his uh, fourth grandchild was born over the winter. Sienna Farinella. Tom's uh, son Joe and his wife Patricia. Welcoming. Sienna into the world over the winter. So congrats to Tom. We uh, we love you. We miss you and enjoy retirement. You deserve it. Two strikes on Arroyo who struck out in the first 0 for 6 in the series. Make it 0 for 7. Well, Big John is locked in here tonight. Oh, executing every pitch. Whether it's the cutter, the changeup this time, it's a backdoor curveball. Easy pitch for a hitter to give up on. One hit for the Giants. That was the Ruggiano single in the second inning, but he was erased on a nifty double play. So Lester has faced the minimum to date. Send out condolences tonight to the family of Ron Gordon, who recently passed away. Ron was a huge Cubs fan. And Belt, a real patient hitter, takes a lot of walks, over 100 last year, but he just struck out for the second time tonight. Lester mowing him down through four. So why do your low fares come with two free bags unlike the other guys? Cause I know I can treat you better. And why do your low fares stay so low? Cause I know I can treat you better. Why am I wasting time with that other airline? <laughs> when you should be with me instead. Yes. Hmm? What? <laughs> Southwest. Hey Chicago, say yes to low fares with nothing to hide. That's transparency. So I'm never gonna let you go I'll hold you forever Oh baby, I'm gonna let you know We belong together We belong together Your home, your auto 
Together, they're where life happens. That's why State Farm protects them together, to help life go right. Combine and save. Talk to a State Farm agent today. Subway $6 footlong sub of the day. Big on taste, small on price. Nice move. Right now, during the Toyota Time Sales Event, you can lease a spacious new 2017 Highlander for $3.39 a month. Hurry in. These deals won't last. Toyota, let's go places. Closed captioning of Cubs baseball on Comcast Sportsnet is brought to you by U.S. Waterproofing. A little seepage in your basement is no need to panic. Count on the experts at U.S. Waterproofing to diagnose and repair the problem. For a free consultation, visit uswaterproofing.com. A better basement starts with us. Cub fans, come out and support your world champion Chicago Cubs. Tickets are still available for the next homestand, which begins uh, June 2nd, especially for the Marlins series. Get your tickets now at Cubs.com. Hey, remember the name Anthony Gose, G-O-S-E? Mm-hmm. Major League outfielder, speedy guy. He has uh, tried his hand at pitching. 8 2 Bryant tap foul. He's now in the low minor leagues in the Tigers organization. And in his minor league pitching debut last night, he was clocked at 99 miles an hour. Mm. How about that? Yeah, I knew he was uh, trying to make it as a pitcher. I didn't know he could throw 99 miles per hour. And a left-handed pitcher at that. Cueto's 1-1, one, one, just missed low. Blue Jays are in Milwaukee tonight, and Jose Bautista is starting at third base. First time since 2013. Remember Bautista way back when, uh, as a pirate, among other teams, he he played all over the place. Yeah, b before he became Jose Bautista, the <laughs> big-time slugger, he was this utility line drive type guy, and kind of had the extra man reputation. Floated in the right for a base hit. Leadoff single, Chris Bryant, and now Rizzo. Remember when Bautista started hitting home runs up there in Toronto? Having that conversation. Is that the same guy that used to be with the Pirates? Played a little yeah. third, little second. Well, we'll keep an eye on that one tonight. Rizzo in the air. Towering shot to right. Two run home. For nothing. Cueto well, keeps finding the middle of the strike zone, and the Cub hitters keep finding the seats. A couple solo shots. Now this two-run blast off the bat of Anthony Rizzo. There's your Ford home run replay. High, deep, and gone. Number nine for Big Riz. So he's four out of 27 against Cueto. Two of his four career hits have been home runs. Swing and a miss by Hap. Giants dugout, I think, giving it. To Corey Blazer, pitch number two should have been a strike. That one inside, and two and one. Oh. 
Broken bat roller, panic. That's the play. Uh, Blue Jays lead 4 0 at Milwaukee in the top of the fifth. Under the roof at Miller Park. Batista has two hits. Hayward homered in the second inning. One on Jason. And then he fouled it right at the plate. One and two. And it works with that quick tempo. Does not waste a lot of time. Even when he's getting hit around a little bit. Maintains that up tempo approach. Yeah, you need uh, to be on the same page with your catcher for sure, considering all the different pitches he throws. I mean, he obviously can be very effective. The, the deception he gets when he turns his back to the hitter or he uses that quick pitch. And sometimes location can suffer because of it. Got him on a changeup. Punched out six. He's allowed three long ones. Can't really blame it on the wind either. It's pretty calm here tonight. Get Robinson Cano back off the DL tonight. He is hitless, however. And the Mariners trail at Washington 10 to 1 in the seventh inning. Anthony Rendon has three hits, five RBIs, and two home runs. Well, speaking of home runs, Schwarber in the first, Hayward in the second. Rizzo, two-run blast. A little stat cast action. And they're dancing in the bullpen. Four nothing. You're a brave man, Mr. Stevens. Your testimony will save lives. Mr. Stevens, this is your new name. This is your new house and a perfectly inconspicuous SUV. You must become invisible. I'll take my chances. I guess I was born with a crayon in my hand. I decided to see if there was a way for design to play a positive role in what was going on in the world. There's a jacket that's reflective for visibility, sleeping bag jacket, jackets that turned into tents. I usually do my fashion sketches on the computer. I love drawing on the screen. There's no lag time at all. It feels just like my markers. With fashion, you can dress people and help people. It's really cool to see your work come to life. One drive in the most awarded and best-selling SUV brand and discover that the world is your backyard. Hurry into the Jeep Memorial Day event for $500 bonus cash on Jeep Cherokee. Now get $4,000 total cash allowance or 0% financing for 60 months on the 2017 Jeep Cherokee. I'm done with golf. Sick of this parking lot. I hate my clubs. I don't even know why I wear this stupid visor. Ah! 
Same time tomorrow? Yeah. Best-in-class cargo space plus best-in-class performance. The BMW X1. Lease a BMW X1 for as low as $339 a month. Lester back out to the bump with a 4-0 lead. This is your Miller Lite game report. And with three long balls already tonight for the Cubs, it means the bullpen has been busting a move rather often in this one. And I guess this is a thing now for the Cubs, you guys. Big offensive plays, defensive plays. You're going to see uh, a lot of dancing from the bullpen. And I had a chance to uh, talk to Kyle Hendricks, who said, yeah, us in the dugout, we feel like we're missing out. He said he's even been tempted to run out there just so he can get to dancing and uh, Wade Davis maybe he'll have to head out there early too right because these guys are getting left out so they're having fun with it and certainly the crowd's enjoying it every time they throw it up on the big board I would pay money to see Wade Davis <laughs> Wouldn't you? Me do too. That. I'm, I'm, <laughs> I'm not sure JD that's something I would expect Wade to do but Joe likes to get guys out of their comfort zone so who knows I would imagine that uh, <laughs> <laughs> it's he has a minimalist approach to the bullpen <laughs> dancing celebration lead off double by Posey now Ruggiano who is the only other giant hit and he takes a strike. <laughs> Cubs are four and two on what has become a nine game homestand so one more win it'll be a better than 500 stay and then after this series the Cubs head to Los Angeles a league championship series rematch yeah, out for a week, out for uh, what uh, six games, and then right back home here for another long homestand. A ten gamer, the Cardinals, the Fish, and the Rockies. So chance to do some damage, and get on a bit of a roll. Muster with his four-run lead has been very efficient tonight. Swing and a miss. To strike out Ruggiano. Usually doesn't uh, elevate very often, but certainly can do so effectively from time to time. And he throws one up in the eyes of Ruggiano to get the chase. It's his seventh strikeout. Crawford takes in the dirt. One and nothing. That's in keeping with the, the trend this year, his ground ball rate is up fairly significantly over last year. Trouble into the right field corner. A fair ball. Posey will score. Looks like Hayward is going to put his hands up as that ball looked like it might get lodged. But it's a double for Crawford, and it's now four to one. Crawford uh, he's always hung in there pretty well against left-handed pitching. And John was yielding just a 200 batting average. The lefties with very little slugging. He's not allowed a home run to a left-handed batter this year. He loses sight of that ball initially, so that's why he throws the hands up, and then it emerges, and he does the right thing, picks it up, makes the play. If not, Crawford's going to circle the bases. So the Giants are on the board. 
And the pitch to Nunez. Shallow center. Base hit. Crawford didn't get a great read on it. So it can only advance one. And Nunez has a new career high 10 game hitting streak. It's rising up here, making some noise in the top half of the fifth. A couple of doubles now, a little flare into shallow center. That's a tough read for the base runner. Easier to tell from our perspective up here that that ball was going to drop in than it is from down there on field level. We'll see what the Bruce Bochy has in mind here. First and third, one out, and the pitcher on deck. All of a sudden, the tying run is at the plate. So we've got Bryant, even with a bag at third. Rizzo holding on the runner. Zobris plays in. The only guy back is Russell as Nunez took off for second and then Hernandez fouled. One quick note on the lineup the decision for Joe tonight came down to offense versus defense either Zobris or Baez and we've seen Baez at second base a lot with Lester on the mound but Joe went with Zoe instead. Yeah it's a hot zone these days yep. he's really been swinging the bat well you know with Ian Happ's emerging too that's costing Baez some some at bats. Uh -huh. Getting a playing time in the outfield forces Zobris into the infield a little bit more frequently. Big lead by Nunez, time called at the plate. And it was Contreras, the catcher, who had requested time. Everybody knows that John doesn't like to throw the ball to first base, and with a man on third, there's no way he's going to throw over there. Nunez runs. Throw goes through. They got him. And Crawford held it third. Best case scenario there for the Cubs. Yeah, I think if you're going to put a play on there, you would want Crawford to be coming down the line a little bit with an idea towards a possible double steal here at the bottom of the batting order. Try to get creative to steal a run, but that was not the plan at all. <laughs> a perfect throw by Contreras. Man, that was a seed. Lester is so good at varying his times to the plate. Holds the ball. That time went a little faster. Boy, if now if you can get Hernandez, you could face Cueto to lead off mm -hmm. the next inning. I mean, I don't want to get yeah. greedy, but yeah, well, they it do. Likely be a pinch hitter. But yeah, absolutely. And that's why I thought I was thinking maybe safety squeeze, maybe double steal, just something out of the ordinary there to create some offense. Swing and a miss, and that's it. So he limits the Giants to a single tally. And the Cubs lead four to one. It's an official game now. The first Binnies laid down roots in the shadow of Wrigley Field in 1948. Still family owned, Binnie's has become Chicago's number one destination for wine, spirits, and beer. Binnie's Beverage Depot, helping you celebrate the best times of your life. Okay, got it. Rumor confirmed. They're playing. What? We gotta go. Where? San Francisco. When? Friday. We gotta go. Any airline, any hotel, any time. Go where you want, when you want with no blackout dates. The Travel Rewards Credit Card from Bank of America. It's travel better connected. Today we're gonna to be comparing the roll form steel bed of the Chevy Silverado to the aluminum bed of this competitor's truck. Awesome. Yeah. First, let's check out the aluminum bed of this truck. Wow. Holy moly. Full on crack here. Now let's check out the steel bed of the Silverado. I'd expect more dents. <laughs> no holes. Qualified lessees can get this Silverado All-Star Edition for around $269 a month. Plus, find your tag and get an additional $1,500 lease cash on select Silverado pickups in stock.
Find new roads at your local Chevy dealer. I got to make a lot of tough calls. Does Italian beef go better with Chianti or with a floral Chablis? Shopping at Benny's Beverage Depot is always the easy call. Don't argue with the ump. If you can't find it at Benny's, it's probably not worth drinking. Play ball. Hi, I'm David Kaplan here with an unlimited baseball break brought to you by our friends at T-Mobile. Coming up later tonight on In the Loop, we'll have highlights and reaction from Wrigley after tonight's Boggy Plus former Cubs manager Jim Riggleman looks back at the 1998 home run race between Sammy Sosa and Mark McGuire. Plus NBA and NHL playoff action come your way after the postgame show. LeBron is in trouble. But now back to Len and J.D. at the Friendly Confines. Cap, thank you. We want to welcome all our viewers watching tonight on Independence Telecommunications Utility in Independence, Iowa. Addison Russell lined out to left in the second inning. Jason Cueto and takes a slider for a strike. Yeah, he has been making a better contact here the last couple of days. This should be routine for Crawford, and it is. Experienced Budweiser bleachers in the left field porch under the video board. This private porch offers a unique view of the game with both sunny and shaded areas. Available in 50 to 100 blocks with unlimited beverages and access two hours prior to first pitch. For more information, visit Cubs.com slash Premier. John Lester with one away. Curve for a strike. Not always easy to identify Cueto's pitches, but Sometimes that curve is close to the slider. Just a little bit of a different break. That was a change up. Yeah, he just was able to shape his breaking ball a little bit differently. It's a little backdoor cutter there. Change up in the dirt. And a two ball two strike count to Lester he did a nice job of limiting the damage in the top of this inning. He's now run it full. He's breaking out all the tricks here against Lester quick pitch change ups little El Teante and treating him like a legit hitter. Swung around to left in the outfield. Buster's well, power is to left center. This time he rolls one up the middle. Backhanded play by Panic. You can follow Patrick Mooney, our Cubs insider, on CSNChicago.com. Presented by Nationwide's Jeff Bukovic, serving the community for 38 years. Go to JeffBook.com. Nationwide is on your side. Well, Lester has a bad career batting average, but he gives you a good at bat. He's got a good swing. And a swing and a miss by Zobrist on the change. So if you had a cereal, what would you put in it? <laughs> you going to try the new uh, Ben Zobrist uh, Zorilla Crunch? Yeah. Toasted oats with marshmallows. Popped up. Yeah, that's all of a bowl. And it's caught. And the Cubs go quickly in the fifth, leading four to one. This is what precision looks like, helping you see what's hard to see. Thanks to Terrain Denali's side blind zone alert that uses radar to watch your blind spots. So it's true. Mom does have eyes in the back of her head. The GMC Terrain with rear vision camera, child safety locks, Stabilitrack, theft deterrent system, and more. 
or use your Memorial Day lease cash to get this low mileage lease on this Terrain SLE1 for around $199 per month. Plus, current non-GM lessees can get $1,500 additional lease cash. Inside the rack houses of Jim Beam, thousands of barrels lay silent. But that doesn't mean they lay idle. In fact, inside each and every Jim Beam barrel, the bourbon is aging, building a fuller, smoother flavor that only comes from being aged four long years. At Jim Beam, our history's made from the inside. How will you make yours? Test drive the new Mini Countryman Sports Activity Vehicle. Today at your local Mini dealer. Catch a brand new episode of Beer Money, presented by Coors Light. Chicago's favorite sports trivia show, where fans are put to the test for a chance to take home cash. Every Sunday night at 7 on CSN. Get your Memorial Day weekend started early tomorrow on CSN as the Cubs face the orange and black for game three of four. Cubs, Giants, First pitches at 7 on CSN or stream live on the NBC Sports app. I join Jennifer Lopez and Derek Huff as the world's best dancers, like these guys here, compete for $1 million. The movement begins Tuesday, May 30th at 9 Central after America's Got Talent only on NBC. Could be David Ross's next gig. Who knows? Sixth inning. Cueto is going to get the uh, at bat here. The ball and a strike on Johnny. Cueto has not thrown that many pitches. This Bochy trusts him to hold the line. Well, he's down a bunt. He's thrown out by Contreras. Well, he's creative on the mound and showing a little of that creativity at the plate. Probably the best explanation of John Lester's home record as a Cub is just that he's really good in general. But it has been pretty remarkable. Last 20 starts going into tonight, dating back to the beginning of last year, 12 and 2 with a 181. His last 15 regular season home starts, as that one has hit hard foul. 11 and 0 with a 160. See Contreras alerting Rizzo to the fact that a slow curve was on the way. Yeah, most guys prefer pitching in their home ballpark, I would say, with the exception of the Colorado Rockies. And I think it's, it's kind of like a golfer who gets a favorite course and just gets used to the, the feel and the look of everything, gets very comfortable. I think that's where Lester is here in this park and you know his, his rotation mates you look at their numbers here too over the last couple of years Hendricks Arietta lackey all outstanding work here in their home ballpark. Well and, and as I said earlier when you're a, a creature of habit uh, starting pitchers tend to be. Kind of knowing the timing of when you're going to throw that first pitch, all those things would seem to matter a little bit. Although tonight we waited over an hour and then even a little longer to get this game started, and it didn't seem to affect Lester in the least. Deep center, half is on the dirt, and he hauls it in. I think there have been a, a 
A lot of the uh, outstanding pitching performances after lengthy rain delays because I think the starting pitcher has so much invested. Uh, it doesn't take him long to, to kind of get reengaged mentally. Sometimes the position players takes them a while to to get back into the flow. Top three in the Giants order. So far combined. over seven with five strikeouts. He started the game by striking out the side in the first. He had a feeling it was going to be a good night for him. Scooped by Zobrist. Got to get a scoop of that Zerilla Crunch. We got to tie it all together. Four to one in the sixth. Hit Escape with great deals on great gear. Like Oakley Holbrook sunglasses for under $70. Only at Bass Pro Shops. The beer that's as refreshing as refreshment gets. Mine and Kugel's Summer Shandy. Over here. This over here. Up here. What's happening? That feeling, only better. Turbo. Standard in a 150 horsepower, fun to drive, Volkswagen Jetta. Hurry in and lease this 2017 Jetta S for just $169 a month, plus a $1,500 Memorial Day bonus. I'm only here for a blue dress. Blue dress, blue dress. Blue dress, blue dress, blue dress. Mm -mm. Blue dress. Sometimes it's hard to leave goodwill with just one thing. Ah, blue dress. But it's okay. With your Club Goodwill Rewards card, you can earn points with every purchase for even more savings. You always amaze me. Another monumental season comes to life with MLB Extra Innings on DirecTV. Catch the biggest moments from baseball's best all season long. Follow your teams, favorite players, no matter where you are. And with MLB.TV included, you can watch nearly 90 live games a week on your favorite devices. That's every milestone and miracle on the screen of your choice. Order MLB Extra Innings on DirecTV. Subscribe to the Cubs Talk podcast on iTunes or the Google Play Store today. Welcome back, folks. Cubs lead 4-1. to one. The Cubs are introducing a game-changing new premier experience at Wrigley Field. The seats featuring prime views and access to an exclusive club. This experience will allow fans to enjoy Cubs baseball in a whole new way. Visit CubsPremier.com to join the premier client priority list. It's new. It's exciting. 0-1 on the Hoosier. Kyle Schwarber. Homer in the first strikeout. And the third. Get in that box, you better be ready to hit because Cueto's ready to go. Half swing bouncer back to the mound. Happy ninth birthday wishes go out to big cup fan Colton Mitchell watching tonight. Pitch from Cueto, fastball too low. Happy birthday to the chairman, Tom Ricketts, celebrating today. Ball two. So make a cereal named after Tom. 
Yeah. It's a little Cindy Lou Who out there. A 2-1 pitch, swing and a miss. Well, it was in a great spot to hit, but it got there late for Bryant's liking. Yeah, great arm speed, and again, he, he jumps at you. It's that quick pitch changeup. It's so difficult to stay back. A rocket foul to left. And fouls it up with velocity in. Bryant able to get the barrel to it. Three and two. The only team Cueto has faced more often than the Cubs in his career is the Pirates. Three two change taken for ball four. Good work by Bryant. Second reach. He singled and scored last time. Cueto. As we mentioned uh, at the outset, has been good in this ballpark. Brought a 3.07 ERA at Wrigley into this start. Towering two-run homer for Rizzo in the fourth. His ninth. at the barrier no play two run shot from Anthony which belt high pumped into the right field bleachers at 102 miles per hour He could not block it. So that'll be a wild pitch. So we'll talk it over. Conversation as to what they want to do with Rizzo here with the base open now. The conversation might not be just about that, but also about not only the next pitch, but the one that follows. I'm going to throw him this. If he doesn't chase me, I'm going to come back with that. Two balls, two strikes. Rizzo chokes up, takes the pitch up and in. Rockies leading big late ninth inning at Philly eight to one Rockies looking for their 30th win. Three two on the way is fouled. Indians and in Reds seven seven in the seventh. Panic. Max 
actually it'll be Crawford to make the play in the shift. So a couple of gold glovers in the area, but Crawford had the better angle. On the play, Brian advanced to third. Two outs, here's Hack. Yeah, if Crawford doesn't get that ball, I think Anthony's got a hit because uh, you see where Panic is coming from. He's got a long way to go, and he's going to have to make a tough throw back across his body. Not that it was an easy play for Crawford either. And there you see the uh, gold glovers in this game. Rizzo won the platinum for the uh, top overall defender in the NL. Cueto from the wine. Posey Panic and Crawford for the Giants. And Rizzo and Hayward winning gold gloves for the Cubs. Deep breath by the right hander. And it is 2 0 is fouled out of play. Red Sox have uh, promoted prospect Sam Travis. First baseman, 23 years old. And I guess for now, he's a right handed hitter who'll only play against lefties. Indiana product. This is Kyle Schwarber and uh, Sam Travis born here in Chicago. Muscle to right and out of play. Sounded like he broke his bat. Yeah, there was uh, something funky. I don't know if he broke his bat or maybe got a piece of Posey with the follow through. Glancing blow off the helmet of Posey. Wow, back. Yeah, Sam Travis went to Providence Catholic High School in New Lenox. So, congrats to him on his big league call up. Welcome to the show. Yeah. Got him looking to end the threat. Bryant stuck at third. It's four to one Cubs as we go to the seventh. When you drive the most awarded minivan of the year, you look like a winner. But back in our pre-Pacifica days, you suffered our share of loss. Dad may be shining like a diamond today, but he wasn't always the people's champion. Thanks to our Pacifica, he knows better now. Just wish he knew better then. Bad boy for life. Now, during the Memorial Day Pacifica event, get $500 bonus cash. Get 0% financing for 60 months, plus $1,000 total bonus cash when you purchase the 2017 Chrysler Pacifica. So I'm never gonna let you go. I'll hold you forever. Oh, baby, I'm gonna let you know. We belong together. We belong together. Your home, your auto. Together, they're where life happens. That's why State Farm protects them together, to help life go right. Combine and save. Talk to a State Farm agent today. Cricket has something epic for you. Our plan started only $30 a month. We've got more 4G LTE coverage than T-Mobile or Sprint. Plus, switch now and get a brand new smartphone for free. Cricket Wireless, something to smile about. Just like we practiced. Okay, we can get started. Fun. Nicely done. During the Start Your Own Legacy Spring event, Lisa financed the all-wheel drive Infinity Q50 2-liter turbo, plus spring bonus at your local Infinity retailer. 
On the latest episode of the Cubs Talk podcast, Cubs Senior VP of Scouting and Player Development, Jason McLeod, joins Patrick Mooney as they discuss the upcoming draft, as well as top prospects Ian Happ and Dylan Cease. Subscribe today. Seventh inning, Cubs lead four to one on three homers early. Schwarber, Hayward, and Rizzo. The Giants got their run in the fifth. The 1 0 to Brandon Belt. Foul fly to left to the seats, one and one. Cubs have had four starts of seven innings this year. Lester with a low pitch count at this point. Line drive, slicing, sliding, catchy, and half. One away. Pretty play. Just a little bit of a hesitation to read the ball, and then off he went. See it right here. Hesitates a beat, and then picks a good aggressive approach to make the sliding catch. Lester owns two of those four seven inning starts. And if you go to John's last start, he went into the seventh with a shutout and a big lead. It was nine to nothing, remember? Mm hmm. And he actually got pulled without getting an out in the seventh. But uh, got the win that day. They gave up with three uh, runs. Three consecutive hits was pulled, and those all came around to score. Back to Lester. And the underhand toss to Rizzo. Two outs. Brian Morris, a right hander up for the Giants. Mark Gardner, their longtime bullpen coach. Foul tip on a cutter. 32-905, the paid crowd tonight. Rain kept a few away. They started 65 minutes late. And the game has had a good pace with two veteran starters who like to work quickly. Mm -hmm. Attacking the zone. Not wasting a whole lot of time. Cubs averaging better than 39,000. Per home game here, fourth best attendance in Major League Baseball. That's where he got Ruggiano last time. Elevated heater. Above the hands, one and two. Brewers coming back. Against Toronto, it's 4 3, Blue Jays in the seventh. <laughs> Off the end of the bat, shallow right, Hayward's got it. Stretch time. It is brought to you by Mazda. For tonight's stretch, please direct your attention to the outfield video board. All right. Let me hear you. Good and loud. On one. On two. On three. Take me out to the ball. Peanuts and crack 
The seventh inning stretch is brought to you by Mazda. Driving matters. Can you feel something without touching it? See something with your eyes closed. When everything is designed around you, the driver, you can. The new Mazda 3. Now get the 2017 Mazda 3 for 0% APR for 60 months plus $500 APR bonus cash. The Thompson family has two wonderful traditions. 58 years of coming to Wisconsin to the same cabin on the same lake. And 58 years of the entire family trying to sink this raft. Some things never change. The raft always wins. And the Thompsons always come back. Colt Kyler is a die-hard Cubs fan whose parents surprised him with Cubs tickets. He quickly turned into a viral sensation. We had no idea that sharing it would go crazy like the way it did. In a recent trip to White Sox AAA affiliate Charlotte, we got a glimpse of budding superstar Yoan Moncada. And Kelly Crawl introduces us to the Zach sisters, how the youngest is hoping to be the first female in the NHL. You'll just get tougher along the way, and that's all you need to do. Just gain the skills, and you'll be fine. A new episode of The Extra Point, tomorrow at 11 on CSN. New pitcher, Brian Morris in for the Giants. Cubs lead 4-1 to one here in the seventh inning. Ninth appearance for Morris. Tough to read too much into the left-right splits considering he's only thrown nine and two-thirds innings. Fastball uh, about 92. He'll also cut it and throw a slider. Came up with the Pirates back in 2012. Was also spent time with the Marlins. High fly out into deep straightaway center. And Hernandez will put it away chest high. The Cubs offer baseball summer camps presented by ATI Physical Therapy and Ideal Industries. Young sluggers ages 5 to 13 have the chance to suit up in Cubs gear and receive top-notch baseball instruction during a week-long camp. Enroll now in one of our five all-star Chicagoland locations by visiting Cubs.com slash kids. Contreras struck out twice against Cueto. Morris signed a, a minor league contract over the winter with the Giants. Battled injury in spring training. Was dealing with a muscle issue. And then when that cleared up, he got hit by a comebacker in a live BP drill, suffering a hairline fracture in his right foot. Well, the only issue I have with that particular injury is I didn't know your foot had a hairline. Well, depending. <laughs> sure, I don't want to get into it, but. I missed most of last year with a herniated disc. 0 oh 2 on the Cubs catcher. Here's the pitch. Swinging a fly ball the other way. Ruggiano drifting. He's got it. Cueto was mostly good tonight, but three long balls really cost him. Six innings, five hits, one walk. So not a lot of traffic, but four of those uh, crossed home plate, he struck out eight. Yeah, I think Cueto tonight was similar to Jake Arrieta's start in St. Louis on the last road trip. Thought Jake was pretty good, but he gave up two two-run homers and the Cubs didn't score. So you know, you're down four nothing. Feels like you had a quote bad start, but if your offense had given you 
some good run support and say, yeah, it was pretty decent tonight. Well, yeah, and you, or if you just think, man, if he just you know, could get away with a mistake or two, Cubs might be a tie ball game. Cubs made him pay. Now hitting three out of the park. Ninety-five, uh, ninety-three, rather, with some movement, but off the inside corner. On Russell. Morris home. That one got away from him as he spiked it. Well, if Lester can get an out in the eighth, it'll be the longest start by a Cub pitcher this season. Gonna head to the eighth. Close at first, got him. Cubs go in order and lead four to one. The Honda Perfect Accord sales event is your chance to get an incredible deal on the Accord, which has been named a Car and Driver's 10 Best List, a record-breaking 31 times. To celebrate, we have amazing offers on the Honda Accord, which has a five-star overall vehicle score. The Honda Accord is also the best-selling car in its class. Race in to the Honda Perfect Accord sales event and get a great deal on the Accord today at your Honda dealer. Ah, graduation day. A time for parents to beam with pride as your youngsters embark on a swell future. All but one, that is. You see, Billy thought it would be neat to try Taco Bell's new boldly seasoned naked chicken chips dipped in a sinful side of nacho cheese sauce. By graduating to these crispy triangles of temptation, the only diploma Billy will receive is a master's degree in being hooked. Actually, it's a bachelor's in fine arts, and these things what are awesome. What a waste. Brought to you by the Council for Eating Fried Chicken the same way you always have, and not Taco Bell. For an interior paint and primer with Stain Shield technology, choose Dutch Boy Platinum Plus from Menards. Its improved formula is up to 50% more stain resistant than leading premium paints. Get the performance you expect from a luxury paint at a price you didn't. Save $9 a gallon. Shaw laminate flooring is beautiful, durable, and easy to install. Hartfield Timber Oak laminate flooring is just 99 cents a square foot. Or choose Nature's Element laminate in five styles, just 119 a square foot during Menards Memorial Day sale. Save big money at Menards. Ford F-Series is the truck leader for 40 straight years. And Ford Super Duty is Motor Trend's truck of the year. Why? F-Series is built to be the best. Delivering capability, fuel economy, and smarts. And now, the F-150 with the STX appearance package is specially priced, making it a value in a class of its own. Now get an F-150 STX for $199 a month or up to $96.80 in total savings. Hurry while supplies last. We move to the eighth. Cubs on top for nothing. This is your Miller Lite game report. And going tomorrow for the Cubs will be Kyle Hendricks, who says... He really steps it up a level when he faces the Giants, knowing, guys, this was his childhood team, his favorite team growing up. Loves when they come here to Wrigley Field. Of course, the last time he faced them in LDS, game two went three and two-thirds inning. He got hit on the arm, came out early, and he said he's really looking forward to going after them again tomorrow afternoon. Thank you, Kelly. One strike on Brandon Crawford. John Lester threw seven innings has yet to get to a three ball count. That's how sharp he has been. And the 0 1 hit on the ground right to Zobris. Yeah, it has been a pitching clinic he has put on here tonight. Posey and Crawford got him for doubles in the fifth, and uh, Nunez with a single, but they just really haven't been able to. Uh, Put a lot of good swings together against Lester. That was the key inning. Nunez got on. It was first and third with one out a run in. And the combo of Lester and Contreras nailed another base runner. As Contreras threw out Nunez at second base. These two guys caught stealing rate over 50 percent. So well above league average and throwing out base stealers this year. I think average is 27 28 percent. 
The 0 1 to Nunez is low. Pretty good chance we'll see Wade Davis tonight. And his left hander Josh Osich loosens. In the air to center. Half in a few steps. Hey, apply for an all digital no fee loan now at eclicklending.com. Eclick is located right here in Chicagoland and rated A plus by the Better Business Bureau. Eclick Lending. Boom! Your mortgage just happened. That was a big boom, too. I'll tell you what, Joe Madden might have to arm wrestle John Luster to get that baseball away from him for the ninth. If his intention is to bring Davis in, they say, you know, Wade hasn't pitched in a week. If I'm Lester, I would tell Joe, hey, what's one more day? Yeah, it's all about the team for sure. Bounce foul. Hernandez. Mike Morris, veteran, is on deck. Zobrist will grab it. Yeah, this will be an interesting uh, conversation here as Lester continues to deal. Toyota Time Sales Event. You can lease a spacious new 2017 Highlander for $339 a month. Hurry in. These deals won't last. Toyota, let's go places. I was dreaming of bigger things and want to leave my old life behind. Take one drive in the most awarded and best selling SUV brand and discover that the world is your backyard. Hurry into the Jeep Memorial Day event for $500 bonus cash on Jeep Cherokee. Now get $4,000 total cash allowance or 0% financing for 60 months on the 2017 Jeep Cherokee. People are talking about the new Buick. With four fresh new models to choose from. And what are they saying? Your new Buick is so cute. Love the new Buick. That's a Buick? Sweet Buick. Experience the new, new Buick. Get this low mileage lease on this 2017 Encore for around $199 per month. Plus, current Buick and non-GM lessees can get $1,500 additional lease cash. Hey everyone, Luke and Sierra with an In The Loop Prime update presented by Bob's Discount Furniture, home of untouchable values. Former Cubs manager Jim Riggleman is going to sit down with Chris Bowden to talk about the great home run race of 1998 and the role of performance enhancing drugs in that. Plus, Mike Glennon speaks publicly for the first time since the Bears drafted Mitch Trubisky and the No Fun League is no more as the NFL is encouraging touchdown celebrations. Now back to Len and Jim at the ballpark who hopefully are going to celebrate a little win tonight. All right, Sierra, Luke, thank you. Hey, the legendary James Taylor returns to Wrigley Field Monday, July 17th with special guest Bonnie Raitt. Don't miss your chance to see this Rock and Roll Hall of Famer. Tickets are available now at Cubs.com slash James Taylor. Josh Osich. And Southpaw will work to John Lester who gets a nice ovation as the crowd recognizes he will get an opportunity to finish this game. Yeah, well deserved opportunity. He has been lights out here tonight. Sturdy left hander Osich on for the Giants. Pitched nine times with the big club. He made nine appearances with their triple A team. A 
93 94 with a heater good curve ball. Oregon State. Product. And Boise Idaho Josh Osich. Just grab the outside corner two and two situation where if you're John Lester at the end of the last half inning you have no inclination to your manager that you're even thinking about coming out of this game you come in you grab your helmet your bat make no eye contact yeah Joe is in his normal spot right there and uh, John came in through the other entrance and went right down to the bat rack to get his bat and helmet. <laughs> they will have Davis up and ready. And we saw Chris Basio on the phone with the bullpen. That's another little uh, side benefit of the bullpen locations, right? Because you can get a guy ready and the starter doesn't have to yeah, see it. Yeah, doesn't have to ponder what you're thinking. Zobrist in the air to deep right. Ruggiano. Makes a nice catch on the warning track. Hefty, hefty, hefty home run time. Schwarber with the longest of his career, about 470 feet. In the rain, Hayward into the basket, and then Rizzo. So it's been a good night for the lefties. It's our hefty, hefty, hefty lefty homers. Like Lester Strode doing a little seated dance move out there in the pen. <laughs> uh, Kyle knocked out the what the B and the U on the Budweiser sign on the uh, Redfield board. You can see they've got that repaired. That was in BP. 97 off the outside corner. By the way, John Lester's previous complete game was here September 2nd last year against the Giants. If you think about that start, a little over a month later. Eight shutout in the division series, and tonight eight innings, one run allowed. Here at Wrigley against the Giants. Pretty good. Going over potential pinch hitters with Mike Borzello. Swing and a miss, and that will take us to the night. Cubs four, Giants one. So why do your low fares come with two free bags, unlike the other guys? Cause I know I can treat you better. And why do your low fares stay so low? Cause I know I can treat you better. Why am I wasting time with that other airline? <laughs> Yes. Hmm? What? <laughs> Southwest. Hey, Chicago. Say yes to low fares with nothing to hide. That's transparency. A supercharged muscle car goes 0 to 60 in 3.1 seconds. The chain of an echo chainsaw, 0 to 60 in 1.2. Gentlemen, start your engines. Power on and on. Inside the rack houses of Jim Beam, every barrel's aged four long years for a fuller, smoother flavor. Our history's made from the inside. How will you make yours? If you love to watch what you want, when you want it, 
anywhere you want. Xfinity is the clear choice with this incredible offer. Get internet and TV with a choice of HBO or Showtime for just $29.99 a month. Download the Xfinity Stream app and your content is mobile. Ask how to get up to 75 megabits of download speed for just $10 more a month for 12 months. Get started today with in-home internet service of 25 megabits per second, all for just $29.99 per month for one year. Call 1-800-XFINITY today. Announcing Hyundai's Better Than Ever sales event. Come in now for the biggest savings in our 30-year history on select new Hyundais. Like up to 5,000 total savings on the 2017 Santa Fe Sport. Really? Wow. And every new Hyundai comes with an amazing warranty. America's best warranty. Hurry in before the best offers in Hyundai history are, well, history. Better is the reason to buy Hyundai. Better Than Ever is the reason to buy now. Lease the Santa Fe Sport for $149 a month or get up to 5,000 in total savings. Visit buyhyundai.com today. The toast of the game presented by Benny's Beverage Depot goes to John Lester. Benny's is the official champagne provider of the Chicago Cubs. There have been 15 complete games pitched in Major League Baseball this year. John Lester looking to uh, become the 16th to turn the trick. Uh, it was OK tonight. Lester brilliant. I think there was one earlier tonight as well. Urban Santana. And for the Twins in Baltimore as Michael Morris off the bench takes a strike eight in the National League nine of the 15 NL teams currently without a complete game performance so Zobris now and left Baez at second yeah and I guess he wouldn't be the 16th to do it because Nova and Stroman have each done it twice and I guess if Santana got one tonight I think it would be his second as well. That guy's been unbelievable. Yeah. Top he goes to get the punch out. Follow Cubs baseball live with the MLB.com at bat mobile app. Stay connected to the game's best players all season long with game day, live game video highlights, radio broadcast stats, news, and more. Download MLB.com at bat today. It's your number one app for live baseball. Joe Panic. In there for a strike. Twins beat the Orioles two to nothing. Santana with a two hitter. John in the zone right now, where as a pitcher you just you know exactly what you want to throw. As soon as you get the ball back, you can almost visualize the result of the pitch. Strikeouts for Lester. Well, he struck out the side to start the game. He just wants his 27th out, but bookends would be kind of fun. That would be a great way to finish. He's got a chance to pitch a Maddox here tonight. Complete game, less than 100 pitches. Arroyo, strike one, curveball. Strike away. Looking for his fifteenth. 
career complete game. And his fourth as a Cub. Live ball, left field. Zobris has it. Cubs win. It's a Maddox. A 99 pitch complete game win for John Lester. Masterful performance. As Len mentioned, 15th career complete game, first since of September of last year. <laughs> he got the sense he could probably go two or three more innings the way he was clipping along. You know, that is right. If ever there were a, a guy who could go into extra innings in this era, it would have been John tonight. Cool night. He likes to sweat, as we know, but it didn't look like he had to work as hard as he normally does. No, I'm sure he, he did, but he made it look easy. The, the one inning where they made a little noise and, and scored their one run, but other than that, he was in complete control of this ball game and the execution of the pitches. Man, if, if you want to throw that changeup down and away, he, he got it there. He elevated the fastball on occasion, which he normally doesn't do. But the situation called for it. He made the pitch. And even I think he threw a couple, at least a couple of left on left changeups, something we don't normally see from him. And I think that changeup is the pitch he's used more frequently this year and, and to great effect. Very little traffic for either team. Cubs and Giants combined to leave two men on base tonight. So the Cubs win four to one to improve to 23 and 21. Such a good feeling for a pitcher to be able to go the distance, not need any help. Just take it to the house all by yourself. Two hours and five minutes. On the Diamond, our On the Diamond interview is presented by James and Sons Fine Jewelers. Kelly. All right, guys, thanks a lot. Well, John, your last complete game, September of last year, against the same Giants team. How good did you feel out there tonight? Uh, all right. I mean, we were able to, to mix the ball around, had a pretty good feel for. Uh, for both my curveball and my changeup, so we were able to use those, and um, they were pretty aggressive against me tonight. So we, we got some quick outs early, and uh, just kind of built off of that. And then, obviously, when the offense scores four off of Coito, that um, you know you try not to let that go to waste. I was just joking with you. You don't think you could have gone another inning? It sure looked like you were in the zone out there. No, I'm I'm, I'm glad it's over. I'm dead. I don't like these uh, these rain delays and waiting around and then hurry up and go and, and all that other stuff. So. Uh, I'm just glad we won. So, um, you know, it's good. I, like I said, I'm glad it's over. It was an interesting start to the night. How do you deal with a rain delay like that and come out and strike out the side there in the first inning and uh, be that locked in? Uh, I don't know about locked in. We, we were just able to, to execute our pitches. The, the the strikeout pitches were there, and um, we were able to use them. And, um, you know, I, I don't know. You just try to stay. You, st you try to keep telling yourself you're going to play the game. You're going to play the game so you don't shut off and, and – uh, you know, turn towards tomorrow. So um, I just kept trying to tell myself we were going to play the game, and then they said, hey, we're starting at seven. So it's kind of go time after that. You mentioned the three long balls tonight. Do you at any point like watching what the bullpen is doing now after these guys go deep? I, what's the only thing that's that's changed is it's in the in enclosure now. I mean, they were doing it last year. So it's fun, man. I mean, everybody everybody's having fun. I'm glad we're getting back to that. Um, you know, you could kind of tell guys early on we're pressing a little bit just to uh, kind of get going and now everybody's having fun and um, you know hopefully we can keep we can keep this thing going for a little while. Awesome enjoy this one John thanks for your time guys 15th career complete game for John Lester masterful performance tonight and he's just glad the team got the W. Thank you Kelly and John receives a gift card courtesy of James and Sons fine jewelers. I also like how he uses the word we even though he was probably the best cub today. We're back with you tomorrow night, 7 o'clock Central Time. Cubs host the Giants for game three of this four-game set. And for J.D., for Kelly Kroll, our entire crew, Len Casper with your final once again. Cubs four, Giants one. More to come. Blue Cross, Blue Shield, Cubs post game live is next. Time to dance and sing.
Well, that was a snappy two hours and five minutes of John Lester domination, and the Cubs get enough offense up Johnny Cueto. He's David DeJesus. I'm David Kaplan. Let me tell you something. That was what that bullpen needed, get another day to rest, and John Lester was awesome. I mean, that was fun to watch. That's John Lester in his prime at his best, attacking the zone, putting guys in ways when he wanted to. It was just a dominant performance. Yeah, it's funny to listen to him with Kelly, and he's so, yeah, yeah I didn't, I don't know if I locked <laughs> in, I don't know if I had my best stuff. He was outstanding tonight. <laughs> All right, we'll hear from Joe Madden. We'll hear more from John. We will have highlights and everything else for you. Don't go anywhere. Cubs get it done tonight. They yeah. win. They beat the Giants behind John Lester. We'll be right back on CSN. It's not just a car. It's your daily retreat. Innovative technology, refined styling, that feeling you can only find in a Lexus. Go ahead, spoil yourself. The ES and ES Hybrid. Lease the 2017 ES350 for $349 a month for 36 months. Experience amazing at your Lexus dealer. Line and Kugel's Summer Shandy combines German style vice beer with the taste of natural lemonade. It's as refreshing as refreshment gets. Line and Kugel's. Welcome to the Liney side. Subway $6 foot long sub of the day. Big on taste, small on price. Dance on over. Well, I love it. This piece is so you. I know, right? I saw it and I was just like, oh, I have to have it. Is it suede? It's suede. Love suede. State Farm knows that for every one of those moments, there's one of these. Well. I love it. This piece is so you. I know, right? I saw it and I was like, have to have it. Is this suede? It's suede. I love suede. That's why we're there with renter's insurance when things go wrong, but also here with a rewards credit card to help life go right. State Farm. Baseball on CSN Chicago is brought to you in part by Southwest Airlines. Yes to low fares with nothing to hide. That's transparency. Your Chicagoland in Northwest Indiana Honda dealers, as reliable as the cars themselves. Xfinity. Xfinity X1 will change the way you experience TV. Toyota. The Toyota Time Sales event ends May 31st. Hurry in today. Toyota, let's go places. And by State Farm, here to help life go right. 